Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. I am back with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how I created these unicorn vibe type of nails like rainbow, um, a color vertical ombre. These nails were inspired by Zule and I'll be using all of her um, glitters from her floral collection to create this look. Right now I'm just showing you guys all the colors so take note of the colors and the names of them if you guys want to shop Zule. The link to her site is always in the description below my videos as well as, um, well, I'm showing you guys here so you don't have to go watch, go back and watch the swatch video I made but anyway. Like I said, this set was inspired by her, a set that she had did, and hers was so, so bomb, so I wanted to do a set similar, but instead of using, like, a couple of colors on the nails, I wanted to challenge myself to use all eight of the glitters, um, it's eight in this collection, on one nail, so that is what I'll be doing here, um, an eight color vertical ombre. So without further ado, y'all, let's get right into the video. The tips that I have on, of course, are acrylic creameries, 3XL no curve square tips, and like I just showed you guys there, I am also using their size 12 Kalinsky brush, and I wanted to go ahead with a smaller brush because in order to fit every single color on the nails, I have to go in with that small, you know, like detailed brush so that I can fit them all, and right there was my little practice nail, so we're gonna get right into it, y'all. So, of course, like I said, we're going to be doing this like a rainbow. And if you guys want to see like the names of each color, go ahead and um, go back a few seconds and screenshot the colors. Um, we're going to go with the blue first, and then the green, then the yellow, then the orange, and then the peach, and the pink, and uh, all of that. Magenta and purple. Um, the whole rainbow, y'all. So, let's get into it. Now that I think about it, this is my first time doing a vertical ombre. I've always done like, you know, like the regular horizontal ombre. I think I did pretty good with this vertical ombre. Um, and it came out pretty cool. Like all the colors were so beautiful, but you guys will see. And it was much tougher. Well, this is tough period, but it was much tougher doing um, the pinky nail because it is a smaller space you get like less space to work with so I had to try my best to incorporate all of the colors the best way I could um, with this you know small space Thank you. 
all right y'all so that's how the first one is looking so super cute and like i said since that nail is smaller like you know you can't really see all the colors like truly but um you guys will see them like even more on the rest of these nails and of course we're gonna do the same exact thing to the rest of the nails
all right y'all this is how we are looking with the vertical ombre complete with all the colors it is so beautiful i absolutely love it and now i'm going to go in with mia secrets cover pink to ombre this all together then cap and move on Right here, I'm just showing you guys that I did switch to, for a second, Nail Houses size 16 Kalinsky brush, but then I switched back to Acrylic Creamery size 12 Kalinsky brush. All right, y'all, this is how the nails are looking super cute. And now I'm going to go ahead and take this clear acrylic and cap the nails. And then I'm going to move on to shaping and filing.
all right y'all so this is how we're looking with the nails caps and this looks so cool i can't like put my finger on right now what these nails remind me of but they're so cute anyways y'all we're gonna hop right into shaping i'm gonna start with filing the surface of the nails then underneath and then the sides the tips and sealing my cuticle if you guys want to end up shaping tutorial you can check that out on my channel i can link it below as well All right, y'all, so on to the part that you've all been waiting for. The giveaway, the 10K giveaway is over. If you don't know about the giveaway, I am so sorry, but don't worry, we'll have many more. But anyway, I have chosen the winners, and like I said, they are completely chosen at random. So without further ado, here are the winners for the 10K giveaway. So there's four winners total, two for each prizes. And for the first prize, which is the YouTube essential package, like um, the YouTube intro and outro for, you know, branding your channel. The first winner of that prize is Jamro. It's just Masia. Congratulations, girl. You have won the YouTube essential package rise thanks for the love and the support and i see that you left no contact information so hopefully you see this as well as um email me or message me to claim your prize and um just real quick to inform you guys for the winners if they aren't or if they don't claim their prize since i did um, include in the instructions to leave your contact information and like I mentioned in one of my previous videos it's funny because not one single person did it so that means no one followed the rules but hey if any of the winners don't message me to claim their prize within 48 hours I will choose another winner but again must see a girl I think I'm saying that right I hope I am um, congratulations and message me to claim your prize all right, the second winner for that same prize, the YouTube Essential Prize, is Queen of Bling Nails and Beauty, my homegirl. Hey, girl, I know you're watching. Congratulations, you are the second winner of this part of the giveaway. It's so funny when I saw that you had won, I was laughing because I remember someone saying that, um, you were gonna win because you have the best luck and I guess we win like a lot of giveaways um so I guess that statement is true <laughs> but I'm glad for you and thank you so much for supporting me you are like one of my biggest supporters like top maybe my top one or two yeah definitely like top one she's always under every single one of my videos um leaving love like she's always the first one to comment on every single one and just everything Thank you so much, Queen, for supporting me. And contact me via email or Instagram to claim your prize and so that we can get started on your project. All right, y'all, we're gonna hop straight into the second prize of this giveaway and the last two winners. The first winner of the custom acrylic press on set is the one and the two. I'm like, I've never seen this person before, but I recently learned that you are the real per or something like that on Instagram. I see you all the time um, under my comments. Supporting me, girl. Thank you. And congratulations. Contact me. Or actually, I think you left. I think you are the only one who left their contact information. So I will be emailing you, letting you know that you are the winner of the giveaway. And again, congratulations. All right, y'all. And the last winner of the giveaway is... Aviance or Aviance Gainey. Hopefully I said that right. I'm normally good with names, so I hope I said that right. But congratulations, you have won the acrylic press on set. So contact me to claim your prize. All right, y'all, that is the end of the giveaway and announcing the giveaway winners. Thank you to those of you who has entered the giveaway and to those who hasn't entered the giveaway and are my supporters. I appreciate every single, what, 13K of you. We're at 13 now, y'all. It's crazy. We just hit 10K, but 
I am very grateful. I appreciate y'all. And let's get back to the video. So as you guys can see, I have shaped and filed the nails already. And now at this moment, we're moving on to the bling part. I'm going to be um, only doing bling on the middle finger because I feel like this set, you know, with the glitter in itself is already enough. I just wanted to add a little bit of bling. So I said, let me just do it on one finger or one nail. You guys ever notice how we always say finger, but it's really the nail, like the fingernail. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, so of course I'll be going in with the Zule Blink Adhesive to apply my stones. And y'all, excuse any vibration you may see with the camera. It's because I have my speaker on my desk and I'm playing music. I try to remember like when I'm filming to take it off my desk so you guys don't see any vibration. Um, and I've been doing really well with that lately. But anyways, y'all, I'm top coating this nail right here so that I can see like the colors truly so that I can, you know, see which bling colors that I want to incorporate on the nail. So I'm doing a little fancy design on this one. This one, this like little stone placement here, I don't know if you guys noticed, this is like one of my favorite stone placements, um, like this design. I kind of changed it up a little bit, but it's pretty much like almost kind of like the same I've been using lately. I really love it. Um, also, one of you guys asked me, I don't know, yeah, it was one of you guys. I'm trying to remember who asked me. I can't remember if it was like Kelly or another one of you guys. I can't remember, but one of you guys asked me if I could do like a bling placement video. Um, and I can definitely do that for you guys. I've been thinking about it lately. So yeah, I'll get that together for you guys. So right now I'm just using or pouring out some bling from this pack here that I got off Amazon. And y'all, this was a scam. Like I ordered this on Amazon and I thought these stones were going to be bigger, but they were not. Like they played me, but it's cool. I guess like reading is fundamental, like the sizes and stuff. Um, they're still cute nonetheless and I'm still able to use them and I'm going to use them because I'm not wasting my money. But um, <laughs> anyways, I'm going to go in with a bunch of different color um, crystals that are you know similar to the glitter on the nails like you know that color sort of like the unicorn rainbow vibe we already got going on here and i'm gonna be quiet now and let y'all just finish watching the rest um i didn't talk through this whole video because i feel like i talk a lot sometimes sometimes i can get like a little carried away like with explaining and just talking a lot and so sometimes i like to do quiet videos you guys will get like quiet videos every now and then maybe you'll get them a little bit more um and i'm doing it again so um <laughs> i'm gonna let you guys finish watching and yeah
all right y'all so this is how this nail is looking very very beautiful now i'm going to go ahead and top coat the rest of the nails so that you guys can see the glitter reveal isn't it so pretty like this is crazy this is crazy pretty um but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and top coat the nails and then insert the final results and i kind of remember what these nails remind me of now y'all they kind of reminded me especially the back of the nails like underneath um but they reminded me of like um that sour candy like those strips like that rainbow sour candy like is it sour patch i don't know y'all know what i'm talking about maybe i'll insert what i'm talking about on the screen or something like that but yeah they're so pretty y'all and i highly recommend you guys go pick up um, some of these glitters from again Zule's nail shop or anything else for that matter because her products are super bomb and the link to her website is always in the description below my videos if you want to shop and I highly recommend that if you don't get anything else get her blink adhesive because it's the best top tier best on the market I promise you All right guys, here's my little footage of the final results. They came out so beautiful, you guys. I absolutely love them. They remind me of a unicorn. Like, so pretty. These glitters are absolutely beautiful. I highly recommend you guys go pick up at least one of them. They are so beautiful. It's like, they're my top favorite glitters. And the way they just hit in the sun is crazy. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up leave your thoughts in the comment section below subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notifications so that you are notified each time i post a new video i thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye for now